Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I want to review fragrances from a French niche perfume house that is called Mansera. And Mansera is a very well-known niche perfume brand. That's why I just really want to jump into this video and to start with the first fragrance that is called Sicily. And the packaging of this um, of this sample looks like this. I really like the design. And Sicily is a very summery fragrance that opens with fruity notes of bergamot, pineapple, apple, orange, mandarin, peach, and grapefruit. In the heart of this perfume we have flowers such as rose, violet, jasmine, and ylang ylang, and the base is made of white musk and woody notes. So I really like the opening. It is very bright, summery because of all those uh, beautiful citrusy and fruity notes. And the heart of it is also nice when the flowers come uh, into play. But however, the more I wear this scent, the more um, musky and maybe even soapy it gets. And I don't like that. I don't know why it doesn't work well on me. And it, if you are looking for a citrusy perfume and you're interested in this one, then I would highly recommend you to try it out firstly at the store, just to sample it, apply it on your skin, on your clothes, and just to see how it works on you. So let's move on to the next perfume that is called Roses Vanilla. And this is a feminine scent. It has top notes of water and lemon. In the heart we have rose and sugar and the base is made of cedar, vanilla, white musk and sugar. So this fern is very sweet. And I, I know that a lot of people like sweet perfumes, but this scent is not um, this scent is not necessarily vanilla um, sweet. It is really sugary. So if you're looking for something sugary with a beautiful floral touch, then I think you will love this one because it lasts on the skin so long until you wash it off. Um, the next perfume that we will talk about is called Black Gold and this perfume is a man perfume and it was um, a new release. It was released in um, 2017 and it is a very beautiful niche uh, France for men. It opens with top notes of citruses, lavender, nutmeg, cinnamon and oud. And the middle notes are violet, patchouli leaf, rose, sea note and jasmine. And base is made of leather, woody notes, musk and amber as well as vetiva. So I just want to make it clear that this is not a unisex perfume because I applied it on myself and I just think this is such a really gorgeous scent for men because um, I think that if you're looking for a gift for men, like a man perfume and you don't know which one you should go for, definitely go for this perfume because I think a lot of men will like it. It has a beautiful woody, patchouli, spicy um, scent and it is just beautiful. Uh, it is very easy to wear, it is um, very pleasant and I really like the smell of it, especially uh, the dry down of it. So the next perfume is called Oud Vanilla. And this fragrance is intense. It opens with absolutely intense woody note that is complemented with saffron as well as spicy cardamom and black pepper. Then in the heart we have floral notes and in the base we have vanilla, gayak wood and sandalwood. So the opening is quite sharp with really really strong woody note and um, vanilla comes uh, through the scent more in the base, uh, in the dry down and also the dry down is just for me more pleasant uh, than the opening because it is much warmer and the first time I applied it on myself I over applied it so it was just so too much and my, uh, my sweater literally smells like wood even now, a few days after that. So the longevity of this fragrance is absolutely crazy. It is so beautiful. So if you're looking for something really intense, then go for this perfume because it is quite unique. Not everybody like, uh, likes woody fragrances. 
and also you know when we wear something really light we just don't smell it uh, because there are a lot of people and just all the scents mixed together but this perfume will you will smell always so if you don't care what other people um, think then go for this perfume because it is just really really powerful stuff and the last perfume and also my favorite one is called Oud Cafe and this perfume has such beautiful notes it opens with amazing fruity notes of peach black currant and bergamot then in the heart we have amazing exotic really rich note of coffee as well as amber and floral notes and in the base we have woody notes musk and sweet notes and this perfume is gourmand scent definitely it is also sweet and it has amazing coffee I don't know like background and the opening that is fruity is also very unique because I don't know I just really like that transition from fruity notes to something very exotic with coffee scent and then sweetness so this perfume is definitely unisex I can see a man or a woman to wear it and it is also very long lasting as all fragrances from this brand so yeah that is it for this review I hope that you enjoyed watching it if you see some fragrances from this brand I'm sure that you have already tried them and you love them but if you haven't then definitely give them a try because they have amazing um, longevity not necessarily very unique scents but they are definitely really well done so yeah that is it for this review I hope you enjoyed watching it and you find it helpful and if you did then please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more reviews like this and also make sure that you check out my reviews on other very amazing unusual uh, perfumes and we'll see each other in my next video really really soon so yeah stay tuned Bye.